One of my favourite things to make when I've got a crowd coming over is a cob dip. It's so easy and everyone loves it. I'm going to show you how to make a creamy French onion bacon and cheese cob dip. Preheat the oven to 180 degrees Celsius and then line a baking tray with baking paper. There are two parts to a cob dip, the loaf and the filling. I'm going to make the filling first. Heat up some oil over medium high heat. Add bacon and onion and cook for about three minutes, stirring as you go. When the bacon's starting to brown, turn off the heat and put the mixture onto a paper lined plate. Now all you have to do is mix the filling ingredients together. So take a large bowl and add the bacon mixture, softened cream cheese, mayonnaise, tasty cheese, the secret ingredient, French onion soup mix, and some chopped chives and you just want to mix them well together until it's all combined. And then season with salt and pepper. The next step is preparing the loaf. Use a serrated knife and cut the top off the loaf about four centimetres from the top. And just set the top aside for later. You need to remove the soft bread from the centre of the cob. You want to keep a two centimetre border so that it's strong enough to hold the dip. Tear the bread into three centimetre pieces and place them on a tray. You don't have to use a traditional white cob. You could use a wholemeal or sourdough or even a different shape. This will create different flavours and textures. Put the loaf on the tray and fill it with the dip. Replace the top on the loaf. Pop it in the oven and bake for 20 minutes until it's golden and crisp. Serving is easy. Remove the top and sprinkle with some chives. Serve with the crispy bread and some crunchy veggie sticks. You can't go wrong with this French onion bacon and cheese cob dip, so whip it up for your next party. For the full recipe, see the description below. For more party food ideas, check out our easy entertaining video playlist here.